Our Lord Jesus Christ paid for our sins in hell, refuted. In speaking to the thief on the cross, he said to him in Luke chapter 23, verse 43, Verily I say unto thee, Today thou shalt be with me in paradise. In verse 46 of that same chapter, it says, And when Jesus had cried with a loud voice, he said, Father, into thy hands I commend my spirit. And having said thus, he gave up the ghost. In John chapter 19, verse 30, it says, When Jesus therefore had received the vinegar, he said, It is finished. And he bowed his head and gave up the ghost. In Ephesians chapter 2, verses 15 and 16, it says, Having abolished in his flesh the enmity, even the law of commandments contained in ordinances, for to make in himself of twain one new man, so making peace, and that he might reconcile both unto God in one body by the cross, having slain the enmity thereby. In Colossians chapter 2, verses 14 and 15, it says, Blotting out the handwriting of ordinances that was against us, which was contrary to us, and took it out of the way, nailing it to his cross, and having spoiled principalities and powers, he made a show of them openly, triumphing over them in it. And in 1 Peter chapter 2, verse 24, it says, Who his own self bare our sins in his own body on the tree, that we, being dead to sins, should live unto righteousness, by whose stripes ye were healed.